A conducting wire carrying a steady current I is shaped as shown in the figure below. All connected straight segments meet at right angles. What is the magnetic moment of the current loop? I A B J plus K I A B J minus K root to I A B J plus K I A B K minus J. And to understand what I J K are in this figure, they have already given you this uh, system. So this is x axis, this is y, and this is z. Okay. Now the known formula for us, okay, of finding magnetic moment is m is equal to current into a. Okay, rather the area enclosed by the current. But in this particular case, our uh, loop doesn't appear to be planar, right? It is spread partly in the xy plane and partly in the zx plane. Okay, so to resolve uh, this issue, like how to find the magnetic moment if we don't have the planar loop, the trick that we bring in is we imagine that this consists of two square loops or two rectangular loops. We first complete the loop in the xy plane. Okay, look carefully. We first complete the loop in the xy plane, which is this. Okay. And simultaneously, we also complete the loop in the zx plane. Now, of course, we cannot complete it with the same wire because the directions of the current are different. So it's this. Okay, so by imagining these two wires, which carry currents in the opposite directions, we are saying that our conducting wire is now made up of two closed loops, okay, which are in the same plane, uh, which are, I would say, one is entirely in the x y plane, a closed loop, and the other one is entirely in the zx plane, another closed loop. So this is the key step. Okay, there is a, another problem uh, which we will be solving today, where we will be making use of this trick. Okay, and that trick says if we add conductors which carry equal current in the opposite directions and which have the same length and the same shape, then it doesn't really change anything because whatever contribution one current carrying conductor has that will be cancelled by the other current carrying conductor due to identical geometry but opposite direction of the current okay so now i can say that uh, net magnetic moment which is a vector quantity by the way is equal to magnetic moment of the loop in the xy plane plus magnetic moment of the loop in the zx correct and here is how we proceed firstly let's determine the uh, magnetic moment of the loop in the xy plane that formula is already there okay which is current into area but that is only the magnitude we also need to multiply it by the direction okay or direction unit vector so how will we determine that m bar xy Current is steady, so we can take that I. Area is IAB. Okay, area is IAB. And to determine the direction of the current, we use right-handed curl fingers rule. I hope all of you are aware of that. To determine the direction of the magnetic moment, we first curl our fingers along the direction of the uh, current. So in this case, for us, when we are looking at the screen, that current is flowing in the anti-clockwise direction like this so we will curl our fingers in the direction of the current the thumb seems to be pointing towards us but towards us is the k direction so it will be kk and this is unit vector so usko fir se kisi se divide karne ki zarurat nahi uska magnitude se because it is already one okay can you people now tell me what will be m bar zx magnitude wise it is same because the area that it encloses is also rectangular with a and b as its dimensions so magnitude wise it will be i a b j cap uh, sorry i a b j cap uh, j cap okay now let's confirm that whether it is j cap the current is flowing like this 
okay the current is flowing like this so we need to arrange the fingers of our right hand in that direction okay so when it comes to the red conductor it will be the direction of the finger should be from its right hand to its left hand right so the thumb is pointing upwards upwards is k oh sorry j and that gives us the answer as option a ठीक है इज दैट क्लियर यस नो यस सर ओके सो आई वुड से द ट्रिक हियर इज वी मे इंक्लूड पेरवाइज कंडक्टर्स of identical geometry with opposite directions of current otherwise it is very difficult to solve okay so a simple problem <clears throat> 